I have found it. The one place, the one place that can take away my boredom and this funk that I'm in from playing the same games over and over. If you're anything like me, you get burnt out or you get bored playing these new games that are coming out left and right that just seem to be reskins of older games. On my little journey this last week of trying to find something to, to make me feel fresh again when it comes to video games, I have finally found the one place that brings it all back home. That brings back memories of when I was a kid. My name is Tex, and this is a review video. Blaze.org, a 100% ad-free video gaming website. Now, when I first heard about this website, I was thinking, okay, it's just another clone of mini clips or new grounds. Boy, was I wrong. And although it's a pretty simple website, at the same time, it really shocks you because it has a good amount of games on there and new games are being added every single day. And uh, from the looks of it, it's ran by only one person. So when we go to the website, plays.org, you were greeted with something very simple. You got three pages, three buttons, a banner, and some text. That's it. There's nothing more to it. There's no ads popping up, and it's it's really simple. As you scroll down, you are greeted with a bunch of video games. If you're anything like me, when you were 12 years old, 10 years old, 9, you were on mini clips and new grounds playing Flash games just like this. And they have everything from the arcade classics such as Pac-Man, Space Invaders, of course, their own versions of it. Tetris to RPGs. You also have base defense games, simulation games, a bunch of great games. Now, clicking on any kind of video game, you see that there's, once again, no ads. There's no place to sign up. There's no kind of anything besides focus on the actual video game itself. We see that there's a little description of the game. Uh, they give it their own rating as far as the design of the game, the difficulty, if it, it can be replayed. And uh, as you scroll down, shows you how to play, gives you a place so you can write a review on the video game. I mean, it's, it's really simple. And the best part is that there's no ads at all. Anywhere on this website, there are no ads. So let's just go ahead and just click on begin for this game and uh, as you can see it it works flawlessly i don't really know what to do here flight sim online i probably should have read the description i mean that's why they have it there okay okay i see now so far is a really addicting game like i i don't know why it's simple it's basic but the game is fun and i don't think i'm gonna stop playing this uh today again there's no ads, there's nothing slowing down the website or anything like that. It's very simple. And okay, I just died. Great. Amazing. But still, it's just the whole fact that plays.org focuses on the gamer. The one thing that I see, even in some of the triple A games that we play now, is that it's either pay to win or there's always some kind of pop-up, some kind of news about the game that tells you, hey, buy this DLC. Hey, check out this ad. Hey, check out this. Check out that. This is our sponsor. Blah, blah, blah. I understand why these sites and video games need to do that. But plays.org, they are not like any of these other places. And they have a ton of free games. And it's truly free. They focus on the gamer. And I love that about plays.org. As you can see here, they have games of all types. From Connect the Dots to Soccer Online to break the bubble, cannon shot, knockout, escape masters, kick the ball, base defense. Some of these games you may be thinking, oh, it, it's probably just a rip off game of this and that, that and this. It's fun, all right? I am a huge base defense type of guy. Like I love games where you gotta build your base or you gotta defend just a section of a map, whatever the case is, and they have a lot of that. I really enjoy this website. Uh, I'm glad that I found out about it because whenever I'm in that funk where, you know, all these games are just boring or they just don't sound enticing. But I want to kill some time. I always go to plays.org because it's it's a endless, endless fountain of video games. They give you a little bit of a background on how the site was created, what it's powered by, what the future holds for this site. And it and the guy even tells you about where he came up with the domain name, telling you about all the backgrounds of plays.org. And to me, that shows transparency. That shows a lot of good vibes, a lot of good mojo. And uh, I think it's absolutely amazing. I mean, 
that's one thing that I believe all gamers should stand for is the freedom to play games. Finding that fun in the video games that you love and not worrying about all the other dumb crap that gets mixed into it. There's no kind of competition, although yeah, competition can be fun, but sometimes you gotta go back to basics, all right? You gotta go back to what makes games really fun. And a lot of times that reverts back to the old game systems that we used to play, such as Donkey Kong or Super Mario for uh, the Super Nintendo. Like it's where finding fun in video games came from and plays.org brings it on back. So it, if I had to give this website a rating out of 10, I would probably give it a solid 7.5 to 8. The reason being I don't give it a full 10 is because I have seen a little bit of a slow load time on certain times of the day, uh, which is not too much of a big deal. And the other thing is I wish that they were to category their games a little bit better. Maybe add a sidebar. And within that sidebar have their categories such as base defense games, uh, FPS games, whatever the case is. I do feel like it needs to be a little bit more organized. I, I get it, simplicity, which is absolutely amazing, but still having an easier way to find all of the games would be amazing. So a solid 7.5 out of 10. And I really can't complain about plays.org. I mean, the video games are played through your web browser. It's super lightweight. And last but not least, the owner is 100% transparent on what his vision for plays.org is and what his goal is to do. And it's simple, bringing it on back to the gamer, making things focused on having fun and not so much about money ads, sponsors, it's all about bringing it back to the gamer. And to me, that is the most powerful thing any place can do. So if you're bored, you got nothing to do, or maybe you're just in a Zoom class and you need something to do, plays.org, link will be in the description. It's time to stop being bored out your damn mind and plays the games you want. See what it did there? No? No? Okay, okay. Hope you guys found this video to be helpful. Remember to hit that like button and subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Whether you're into video gaming, cryptocurrency, streaming, whatever the case is, we got something for you and we got more coming. My name is Tex and this is Zexy Reviews. I will see you in the next one.